Hello, I'm Susanna and if you have been following a few of my other videos, you'll have seen the progress which I have made with this unknown wooden doll. Now, just to recap, she was a doll that I acquired a couple of weeks ago from Germany. She's fully wooden, she's fully jointed and articulated, yet she's completely unbranded. So I don't know who made her and she came to me um, from a seller who had kept her completely blank for 20 years and she had bought her from a flea market. So I don't know whether she was a one-off from a factory, was she a prototype? We don't know. So I'm still putting the word out. If you recognize this doll or have seen another one like her or would, please let me know. Now we know she comes from Germany or possibly Switzerland and probably around the late 80s, early 90s because she has that sort of look about her. But I'm, I'm still wondering who she is and I've still got to name her. So um, in my previous videos, I showed about cleaning her up. She had some brown marks on her wood and I used oxalic acid to clean that up. I then uh, gave her a face using some colouring pencils and then I gave her a nice varnish. So th this is how she looks now. So slowly I'm going to build her up. I'm trying to think of a name. I, I go through various names all through the day, but that will come. Anyway, I got a wig and I think I've decided I do quite like this wig. I'm going to stick with it. I was going to um, try some different styles, but I'm actually really happy with this wig. It's a nice sort of golden colour. And what I like about this wig is that it comes from the 80s. The, the seller had never used it, so it's sort of new. Um, but it kind of is in keeping with the era of her because it's from the 80s. And so it's kind of also lost a little bit of its luster, which I quite like. So it, it's got that sort of slightly aged look. Now, I'm going to ask you, I have never stuck a doll wig, I don't think, onto a doll permanently, let alone a wooden doll. And I'm actually loving her baldness. I think I would like to attach the wig to the doll, but I want to make it so it's quite easy easy to take off if I want to because I'm still quite into looking at other styles of wigs online although I do really like this wig what if I decide in a year's time I want to change it so I know there are some glues around which you can peel off is it gorilla glue or something so I'm asking does anybody recommend a particular glue which will hold the wig on the doll but if I want to remove it it wouldn't be that drastic to remove because she is varnished I don't really want to um you know spoil all that um I mean I could use um I obviously I'm England so I've got to use English glues now I love is it bostic glue I think or oh gosh there's all sorts I need your help what kind of glue should I use to stick her with and when you glue the wig on, do you start at the very crown and then sort of peel it over? I mean, basically, I need to know how to stick a, a wig on because um, this is not something I've done before. And she's so precious. I don't want to ruin her. Um, so I've seen some ads where, you, where they have glue on the wall to stick pictures and then they peel the glue off. Oh gosh, anything you can suggest, please, I need your help. So write in the comments what you would suggest um, that I use to stick her wig on, which is preferably something that I can remove at a later date. And I would be so grateful. Thank you.